So this is just a quick tutorial of how to set up the fingerprint sensor on the Sony Xperia Z5 Compact. It's part of the kind of setup process on here. It comes as an option uh, when you select your previous phone and go for all of that. Uh, the other way to do it is if you go into settings, which we can get to just by scrolling on the top with two fingers and pressing settings option up there, or of course you can go through the main menu. Uh, you get to security eventually, and then at the top here it says fingerprint manager. Um, so it says get started. And the fingerprint sensor on the Xperia Z5 Compact is actually on the side here, uh, so it's part of the lock button, uh, which is actually quite useful, I'd imagine, for when you're trying to put your phone on a contact list rather than have it on the front. Um, so we can choose how we want to do it. So we're going to go for a pin because it's easier. I'm just going to put it in uh, four zeros. And then you've got kind of your options for what content you want to show. Uh, and it says the sensor is located on the power button on the right side of the phone, which I've just told you. Put your fingerprint on the right, so I'm just going to pop it on the side. And it just says to lift it off every time you feel it vibrate. Uh, and what you can see is this front bar as I'm doing it is slowly filling up. And then it says it's done. You can, of course, add more fingerprints if you want to. And particularly when um, Android Pay or Google Pay comes to the UK, um, that would be kind of a way of securing your payment. Uh, so just to show you in use, I've locked the phone now. If I do that once the code, or if I just put my fingerprint on the side, it's unlocked. That feels pretty sensitive. And that's how to set up the fingerprint sensor on the Sony uh, Xperia Z5 Compact. It'll be exactly the same on the bigger Z5 as well. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys again soon.